Trouble is brewing within the KwaZulu-Natal government of national unity, GNU, as the African National Congress, ANC, raises concerns about the uncooperative behavior of an Inkata Freedom Party, IFP, member of the Executive Council, MEC. But before we continue, kindly subscribe, turn on the notification bell to stay updated when next we post new videos. According to insiders, the ANC has accused the IFP MEC of obstructing collaborative efforts and undermining key government initiatives. The unnamed MEC is reportedly refusing to engage constructively in cabinet meetings and has been accused of delaying the implementation of crucial development projects. The tension between the coalition partners has reached a boiling point, with ANC officials publicly expressing their frustration. The MEC's actions are detrimental to the progress and stability of our government. We cannot effectively serve the people of KwaZulu-Natal under these circumstances, said an ANC spokesperson. The IFP, however, has dismissed these claims, stating that the ANC is exaggerating the situation for political gain. An IFP representative countered, Our MEC is committed to serving the province with integrity and diligence. These accusations are baseless and are intended to divert attention from the ANC's own failures. The controversy has sparked debate among political analysts, with some suggesting that this rift could jeopardize the stability of the GNU. If these issues are not resolved swiftly, we could see a significant impact on the governance and delivery of services in Kays Yen, noted political commentator Sianda Makais. As the situation unfolds, Residents of KwaZulu-Natal are left in a state of uncertainty, hoping for a resolution that will ensure effective governance. Both parties are under pressure to address the conflict and restore harmony within the coalition to prevent further disruption. The coming weeks will be critical as the ANC and IFP navigate this political storm. The ability to find common ground and work together will determine the future of the GNU and the well-being of the province. Thanks for watching the video until the end. Hope you found it useful. For more updates, check our other videos. Subscribe to stay updated when next we post videos.